All right, folks, welcome back to Desert Willow Ranch. As you can tell, I'm not at the ranch. I'm at the backyard of my uh, house I'm living in now. Uh, I figure we can uh, do a little flannel talk on Sundays um, if it's something that kicks off, if I ever get subscribers, if I ever get people who comment, and maybe I'll start doing this live. I don't know. But uh, we took the day off from going out to the ranch just to enjoy some family time. That's what uh, that's what everybody should do. Um, so yeah, it was a good time today with the family. We went uh, trampolining. All right, we're over here, uh, not at Desert Willow Ranch. We're taking the kids to have some fun at the, uh, the trampoline park, Urban Air. Uh, so that's what we'll be doing. It's gonna be fun. Went to a trampoline park. My knee, I blew out my knee when I was younger, so I can't jump, but at least I was there to hang out with the kids. Then my daughter wanted to, we don't have a, wanted to go to Catopia. We don't have a cat. Um, I told him we can get cats when we move out to the property to help keep the mice out. Um, but yeah, I mean, just to keep your family. That's my, one of my hobbies is just my family, right? I work, I work all day, work all week. Um, weekends are set aside for, for family. Um, I mean, we haven't gone into the past, but uh, I was, you heard from a previous video, I was in the army for seven years. I missed a lot of time with my uh, family, uh, uh, whether it was deploy, being deployed, whether it was field problems, uh, et cetera, et cetera. And then working in the defense industry. Um, I worked at Raytheon for about seven years and I moved to Dynetics. I'm not gonna say where I work now, um, but um, I actually moved with Raytheon more than I did with um, the military. So um, we moved a lot when the kids were younger. We're finally stabilized. Um, the land is basically 20 minutes from my house right now. So it's, it's a nice getaway. So hopefully next weekend you'll see, uh, we'll start getting the RV up and running. Like I said, long-term plans, you'll see in a previous video, um, uh, is building a house, right? I'm not a DIY guy. Um, I am to an extent, but not to the extent of building a house. So, so we'll probably uh, hire some people to build a house. Maybe I'll frame the inside. Um, the state I'm in, you actually have to take a test to pull an electrical permit too. So it's not the easiest thing to do to, to, to do it yourself. Plumbing, they won't even let you do. So you have to hire a plumber, um, a certified plumber. So, um, or get a plumber. You do the plumbing and get a buddy, plumber buddy to pull the permit and it's, so you can get an inspection and it passes. Um, but we'll go from there. Um, but yeah, like I said, I, I work, I'm, I'm on what's called 980. So I'm lucky I get every other Friday off. So that's a nice little benefit to have. Um, so some, some weekends I get to spend more time at the land than the others. And really for where we're at, this January has been really warm. Um, this is the first year I haven't seen snow where I'm at. A lot of times we see snow before Thanksgiving. One year we had snow before, uh, before uh halloween so um so we're gonna build a house maybe i'll show the plans on the house um you do we did hire an architect i do have blueprints we when the state i'm in you have to have uh, a licensed engineer from the state that can actually uh, make the drawings so i cannot that's the dog's plan they're they're a little crazy right now i cannot uh just buy the plans off the internet if i want to pull a permit if i do buy them off the internet they have to get inspected by uh somebody certified so you got to pay them to do that anyway so we just hired an architect uh it's it's not going to be a barn barn aluminium it's going to be just a, a single story house 2100 square feet it's going to be metal we're going to put gutters up we're going to do rainwater catchment and all the the whole nine yards so um that'll be starting soon hopefully uh, we're, I got a quote on the actual building I'm looking at now, so maybe it will start soon. Uh, wells in the area, so my property is around 5,500 feet above sea level. I think wells in that area around me are sitting around 600 feet down. So the whole plan is to do this debt free. So we're going to move out there. I'm not going to have a mortgage. I'll have a solar system up. I'll show you how we do the solar system and whatnot. So the idea would be eventually that we could save up enough money to dig for a well. Um, but we'll we'll do uh, rainwater catchment. We do have a monsoon season, monsoon season where I am. So hopefully we can uh, capture a ton of water and go from there. Um, the dogs they're getting buck wild. They've been stuck inside all day. Say hello, dogs. 
We got sake, we got Hershey. This is the cow chaser. They both were chasing a rabbit uh, at the property the, yesterday. I wish I had the GoPro on. I could, uh, I could have, I could have showed you, but uh, we didn't have to chase after him. The rabbit hid under a tree that was a couple hundred yards out, and then the dogs came back. They couldn't get her, get the rabbit. So thankfully, I didn't have to clean up a bloody mess. So. Um, yeah, I mean, if this ever takes off, that's just a little bit, of, a little insight into our life. Um, yeah, if it ever takes off, this might be a every Sunday thing. Like I said, I might do, a, I might do live if I ever get followers and subscribers and whatnot. And, and, uh, maybe we can do a Q and A. Uh, we'll see. So, uh, hope you all had a great weekend. Um, oh, and by the way, the videos that you do watch are usually of that weekend. So my plan, I try to release them on Sunday. I might do some on Saturday, but I don't have a backlog of videos. That's, it's usually the next day. So I'll edit it, throw it down. So that's pretty close to live. I mean, obviously it's a couple hours off, but uh, we, you're, you're pretty close to, uh, we're, we're day to day on these videos. So I hope you all have a, had a great weekend and have a great upcoming week. Talk to y'all later. Oh, thanks for watching. <laughs>